Hi, I'm Andre. I'm a black nerd. I am at Nickelodeon Animation Studios in Burbank, California, and I'm super excited. I'm going to go to an ADR recording session with the original 1980s Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. They're doing a special episode of the Nickelodeon Ninja Turtles series called Transdimensional Turtles, where the turtles of today in the Nickelodeon show get to meet the turtles from the 80s with the original voice cast doing the voices. Retro meets new. I'm so excited. I'm going inside right now. I'm excited. SpongeBob's excited. You excited, SpongeBob? I knew he was. All right, we're going in. Here we go. Dudes, look at us. We're like more solid or something. Whoa, dudes. Cowabunga! Uh, I think I think there's a Townsend behind me. Cowabunga, dude. <laughs> How are you? Yes. Hey, we had a little bit of fun in there, didn't we? Yes, huh? we did. Oh! Yo! Turtles everywhere! Photobomb, it's Leonardo Photobomb. <laughs> dude, it's a bodacious <laughs> photo. <laughs> It's, it's like if one of you shows up, like a, a magically other suits pop up. It, right. it just happens that way. It is <laughs> our, it is our world. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> it's an invasion. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> We take animation and voice very seriously here at Nickelodeon. <laughs> That's right. So here we are. What was your question yeah, again? Yeah. Tell us I about the complexities and the intricacies yeah. of, of the turtle phenomenon. Okay, it's really easy. <laughs> I get this piece of paper with my name on it, and it says, read these words, and I read these words. Oh, and you read them well, man. You read them well. Well, I try. Hey, guys, uh, now that we're in a new dimension... Pizza time! Far out! Your name is Shredder? You're named after a kitchen appliance? Are you kidding me? Does the phrase go suck a lemon hold any meaning for you? It is surreal. Um, the coolest thing though is always getting to see the original guys, getting to see Cam and Townsend and Barry. It's such a joy. It was just a blast. You might wake up some morning and the sound of something moving past your window. Don't be afraid. It will not harm you. It's only me. Across your dreams and nets of wonder, I taste the bright, elusive butterfly of love. How's it going, Pat? Rav, it's going pretty good. <laughs> That seriously is one of my favorite voices of all time. Like, it is such a good, unique voice and perfect for that character. I can't imagine him sounding any other way than that. Oh no. You're not again! Well, uh, it, it sounds to me like Katherine Hepburn and Ernest Borgnine having acid indigestion in the alley. <laughs> What's going on, Donatello? We've got to think of something fast! <laughs> We've got to think of something fast! <laughs> Could We've got to think of something fast. I am here with Cam Clark, the voice what? of Leonardo. Where? <laughs> Where? He's here. He's here. <gasps> He's here. <laughs> Man, this was so awesome. Watching you do this, be the voice of Leonardo again, it's just like so cool to see this happen live. Pretty, pretty cool for me too, getting to be with my old, my old boys. It's like high school reunion, you know. It was what, 30, how many years ago? Yeah, 87, yeah. 87, 87, 97. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, almost 30 years. But you still got it, man. <laughs> Thank <laughs> That's you. Okay. This is the episode where Donatello finally gets a catchphrase. He waited 10 years to get a catchphrase, and he never got one. So maybe in 3D, he can find a catchphrase. Barry, good to see you. Good to see you, Andre. <laughs> well... At least we have his dimensionizer thing. How insane is that? Is that you're you're here doing the voice of Donatello, and there's also new turtles as well. It, it, unbelievable. And movies. Yes. And, <laughs> and I mean, it's like starting all over again. Well, we came from a two-dimensional reality into a third dimension. It's like science fiction. I mean, it's so funny. You know, I'm teaching now, and oh. and uh, and when I teach it at Cal State LA, I'm teaching this heavy class for the for the TV film department and entertainment and media law. Yeah. And when you know half of them come in with their T-shirts, <laughs> with their turtle T-shirts, <laughs> you know, it's not setting me up as an authority figure. I'll right, tell you. Right. <laughs> well, that, that could teach us some things about copyright. Or <laughs> no, I, yeah, that's what I'm teaching. Yeah. That's what I'm teaching. You better not pirate those shirts. Yeah. You know, <laughs> hey, you guys, it looks like us. Hold the phone, I think we're on the same side. How was it to voice Raphael from the 80 series mm -hmm. having to talk to Donatello from the current series? Really, Donatello? I think you even had a little bit of an exchange. Dude, I talk to myself all the time. <laughs> the truth is, often in, in animated shows, we're cast as several different characters. The problem is when you overlap yourself. <laughs> that's when you really need to see a doctor. You know, Fun the Door can mean something to a few, but why did Rome? I do as the Romans knew. So it was a challenge being able to have all, all of those different 
aspects. No. <laughs> With that, my dimensionizer will wipe out all of your worlds. He kind of has a underbite. Yeah. Kind of prognathic. <laughs> and that was a good look, so I worked that angle. You, you were amazing in there. It was well, so awesome so to much. see you and the gang together. It was so cool. Yeah, it's, it's a wonderful. It's a shower of all my days, <laughs> as Dylan Thomas would say. Cowabunga, dudes! A completely different dimension! A completely different dimension. Of course, you got the right t-shirt on. Oh, you know, had to, had to All right, represent. here's me. I'm looking over the sewer, um, the manhole cover right here. It's where we live, in the sewer, right? And I just have to, like, battle the evil shredder with my butts. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't get much better than that, does it? Bodacious. That's so cool. Come on, guys, let's get serious. Didn't you have Settle both? down, guys. <laughs> get serious. We gotta think of something fast. Stop We've the funny stuff. It's something. my line. We've got to do something <laughs> fast. Stop being funny and let's get serious. <laughs> Quit it. Stop joking around. This is serious business. Fast. <laughs> so good to see you here. Good to so see you, brother. Yes, thank you so much. Bring him back. More cam. Bring me back. <laughs> Bring me back. I like that move. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> See, Leonardo's got some moves to him. He doesn't say cowabunga. He doesn't say we've got to do something. <laughs> he doesn't say anything but let's fix this and put this thing in this and the sprocket and the thing and fix the turtle van. And I'm sick of it. I want a catchphrase. You're the MacGyver turtle. It's so so much fun yeah. for the four of we, We've always had so much fun. And, and it, this is now a new... new New life, new <laughs> life. See you in another dimension. Turtle power! So glad to have you as part of the old turtles, Thanks, part of the buddy. new turtles. Thank you And maybe much. the next turtle. Uh, listen, if I live to be 100, I can do all four of them. <laughs> You'll still be a kid. Yeah, I still will. I'll, I'll be here That's doing right. my YouTube video. Like, I'm, hey, everybody, no, welcome buddy. to Ninja Turtles. That's right. There's cattle's on my chest. Can we break up? Uh, Rob, he's, he's Leonardo now. Clear. Yeah. Clear power. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thank you. My Thank pleasure. You're such my an awesome boy. Thanks. Oh, my gosh. That was so awesome. That was so much fun. I cannot believe. I got to see the original 80s turtles do their voices live. Be sure you check out this episode, Transdimensional Turtles. It's going to be on Nickelodeon, March 27th, 11 a.m. Eastern Pacific Time. Let me know who your favorite turtles character is, any version of turtles that you love. Tell me your favorite character. I love you like a play cousin. I'm Audi 5000, Chain Chomp, yum. Bye!